just what I think a lot of people probably wonder just what the hell is Terra Gaiden? Like what is this guy trying to sell me every goddamn Q&A? You know, it's a book that I wrote eight years ago, like I mentioned. And um, it's a book that was inspired by Suikoden, by Fire Emblem. It tells the story of there's a war going on. Because it's inspired by Suikoden and Terra and Fire Emblem, you know, it needs to have like this empire that's trying to take over uh, the other nations, right? Otherwise, it, that's not Suikoden, that's not Fire Emblem, so... It's gotta be like that, so I got that plot, it's cliche, I know, but the, the, the characters are very interesting and there's a lot of dark and mature stuff in there, and adult characters. Sure, there may be one or two characters that are like 16 or 17, but the majority of my characters are like under, under um, late 20s or mid 20s. And, um, well, the book, it has four protagonists. Uh, the main heroine is Lauren Silverain. She leads a mercenary group that's pretty famous for, you know, because this, this is a mercenary group that, take, that can take on the Empire, that, can, that, that has defeated Imperial soldiers before. So one day, you know, um, the Empire, this Empire, they invade the capital of Alestia, okay? And that's where the second main character comes from, which is Thomas. He's the captain. So they decimate the army of Alestia and this guy says, you know, this is gone for too long, we need to stop these guys, you know, they wanted to colonize the entire freaking continent and we can't let that happen because, you know, we need to be free. Every country needs to be free. So um, what happens is that he knows this priest, that's right, a priest, and that's also, that used to be a military strategist. So he recruits that guy. And he says, what can we do? I need to start a revolution. I need to fight the Empire. We need to come up together, you know, all of these nations together and fight these assholes. So this strategist recommends to recruit Lauren Silverrain, which is the, uh, the leader of the mercenary group that I mentioned. So they go and recruit her and then they form an army. And then they, they fight this empire and there's a lot of battles like, you know, as if you were playing a Fire Emblem game. And it's all, you know, a narrative, you know, there's nothing technical in there. It's not like I'm saying, you know, oh, uh, Lauren moved three grids to the left. <laughs> I know some writers do that. <laughs> but no, 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 it's just a book. It's fiction, you know, it's, it's a normal book. But um, yeah, it's it's heavily inspired by that. I'd say it's more inspired by Fire Emblem than Suikoden because in Suikoden you you create this whole army and you recruit a lot of characters. And at the beginning, I wanted to do something like that, you know, to recruit a lot of characters, you know, that have personalities and stories and whatnot. But I was like, man, so it's gonna be like this big of a book, man. It's gonna be like a five hundred dollar book, and no one's gonna buy it. So let's just let's just say that Terra Gaiden, my book, is a little bit more influenced on the Fire Emblem side. By, by Fire Emblem, right? So, um, that's it. I think it's a great book. You know, my English wasn't that good back then. I don't think it still is. I mean, I'm still improving. You know, I'll probably never stop improving. You know, but back then, eight years ago, it was the very first book I wrote in English. So it's kind of weird. Some sentences <laughs> don't make a lot of sense. I mean, everything makes sense, I, I like to believe. But the words I use to express certain things or certain actions are like kind of, kind of like, I mean, it's just weird. But you got to remember I'm Mexican, right? English is not my main language. So if you can forget that, you know, if you can forgive that, you know, I think you can, you can enjoy this book if you like Fire Emblem or Suikoden, you know. It has a lot of dark stuff. One of the main characters is a necromancer, uh, and she's kind of like schizophrenic. She's kind of nuts, you know, and there's a lot of dark stuff in there because a lot of Fire Emblem games or Suikoden games, there's some dark dramas here and there, but nothing, not, not much, right? And here, you know, man, you know me, I'm into dark stuff and mature stuff. So that's the way I wrote my book, you know. There's a lot of stuff like that. And there are, there's some violence, you know. I don't recommend this book for kids. I've met some fans that bought this book uh, for their 10-year-old kids. And I'm like, well, it's a book. There's nothing visual in there. It's just your imagination. But there's some violence in there, some strong violence in there in that book. So, yeah, it's a mature book, you know. Not really adults only, you know, a, maybe a 14, 15 year old kid can read it, no problem, you know. But, um, you know, I recommend this book because I wrote it myself. <laughs>
and you will find the link to it in the description below to Amazon physical and digital I mean if you're a collector you'd want a physical right there you go Terra Gaiden link in the description